Hi, hello, hi, my name is H Extraordinaire, how are you doing? Uh, I'm back with uh, My Hero Academia, or Boku no Pico, My Hero Academia, My Academia, I'm gonna stop, I don't know where I'm going with this, uh, chapter 236, 236, uh, basically, from what I remember, dad being way too strict on Shigaraki, and... As you can hear in my voice, I'm a little bit sick. Well, I, I was a lot more sick, but since to the... I was... I was worse before, but thanks to Sensei's Hudget Twins, Keith and Kevin, I am now better. I sweated out all the disease. <laughs> Alright. Um, yeah, Chigaraki touched dog, his quirk manifested. I don't know if... Uh, whatever it's a mutation maybe it's a mutation because of stress who knows who knows i speculated a lot on the last video hopefully that wasn't annoying but hey you know what i like to throw out my ideas out there maybe some will stick some probably won't maybe they won't stick at all who knows all right so he touched him and now he's breaking apart okay yay lovely also if you remember from the last one no chapter visuals unfortunately Shueisha just doesn't like that some other companies is fine of that but Shueisha Shueisha's not one of them so sorry Horikoshi Kohei Munchan you mean oh that's brutal I'm on page two uh, whatever that's brutal that's really brutal. Tenko Shimura, Origin 2. Lying down, yeah, that's his real name. Lying down next to him is. Yeah, that's. Uh oh, here comes the sister, yeah. Oh man, this poor guy. I mean, he's done some bad st Well, to be. I guess he's done some bad stuff. Well, we don't know how many people he's actually hurt, but it's safe to assume he's done some bad stuff even though I was the one who said it was our secret I'm sorry also she was did she say it or did the dad just find out no I don't think she she would do something like that I mean plus she, I mean she's a kid so maybe she did she blurted it out who cares hey <laughs> in a normal family the dad wouldn't react that way so man, look how he has this kid it's, it's too much man I mean, there's a you could be you could be a strict parent. That's fine, but this is too much. This is, I, I would say, this is bordering on abuse. But no, this is abuse. This is straight up abuse. Man, I don't even remember the dad's name. It's not. I don't care. He's trash. What's the ma oh boy? She saw it. She looks so much like her grandmother. Like it's scary how much she looks like her grandmother. Okay, I know this is supposed to be like a shocking scene, and this is brutal as hell. Man, that last, the, the penultimate panel is, wow. I mean, you got the dog there, but then you have her face and it makes it seem like it's comedic. I mean, at least to me, because it's kind of a comedic face. They could have eh, they could have maybe done that one a little bit better, but it's pretty. That's, that's pretty brutal. Uh, <clears throat> Page of all. My voice won't work. Of course not. Oh my god, no. No, kid, no. Oh my god. And this poor kid. He came to apologize, right? This, this actually, this. Normally I wouldn't be like. Mm -hmm. Like, I don't get like affected by this stuff that much, but this is just. I don't know why it's affecting me so badly. This time you have to protect me, help me. Yeah. I thought we were being. I guess it's just the idea of just falling apart. Is, it just makes me. Ugh. I don't like the idea. It's, it's creepy. It's too. It's too gruesome. I thought we were being attacked by a terrible villain, but I thought both Monchan. Yeah. Mm. Oh boy. And Hannah, um, 
coming away because of the villain. And at that time, I still had no idea. I feel like in I feel like Shigaraki is gonna be able to turn back, maybe with the help from Deku after like after like just around the end of the manga, they have this big battle, and then he's Deku doesn't kill him, and Shigaraki's in jail or something if he's not dead, uh, and then they. Uh, I guess he just helps him out with all his issues because my god this guy needs some therapy he needs a crack team of therapists 24 7 this poor guy like I don't even my god dude this poor kid oh the ground too oh no the ground the worst casualty oh I feel so sorry for the ground I'm sorry. Oh boy. No, not them too. She is very attractive. <laughs> Shigaraki's mom is very attractive. She, her hair kind of makes reminds me of the Jesus hair lady. The student. Thinking back on it now, I probably already understood even back then, subconsciously maybe. You were just so freaked out that you don't even know what's happening anymore. Honestly, wow. <clears throat> I honestly I love the way Horikoshi draws anatomy the human anatomy it's it's so good it's like it actually looks like people it's I mean it's fine you can have your art style whatever I mean yeah it's fine you can have uh, different art styles and stuff I just really appreciate Horikoshi's uh, realistic uh, his art style when it comes to uh, the anatomy of his characters um, the, uh, I, I just like that because a lot of our artists I mean I'm not saying it's a bad thing I'm just saying it's kind of nice to see something different um, like a lot of artists have like these super unproportionate unproportional um, unproportional anatomy uh, for example I, again let me just say this not a bad thing I'm just saying it's kind of nice to see something different for example uh, this is, I guess this one isn't that good of an example. One Piece, for example, uh, is, has a very unique art style. Not anatomically correct a lot, but it fits the style and it looks amazing. Uh, and then you have all the other one, all the other animes that just have this, I guess, generic-ish art style. You know, the cookie cutter anime art style. I can't, I'm not gonna, I'd, I say cookie cutter, but I'm not like trying to, you know, I like, there's there's a there's a style there's an established style for anime you know that style uh, and it's just it's kind of nice to see something different with Horikoshi at least with the the anatomy of the body it's not super anime it's like actually realistic I like it um, another artist that's kind of like that Araki he has a pretty realistic art style now at least. <laughs> Not when it was Fist of the Jojo. Um, but yeah. I don't know. There's a lot of... I mean, I'm not... It's not bad if it, if it's not, like, accurate to reality. It's fine. Go crazy. Have fun. Do... Try crazy stuff. I love that. I love it. I'm just saying. There's a lot of anime that... that there's a lot of artists that kind of have similar art styles. It's kind of neat to see Hor, uh, Horikoshi have such a, I guess... And not super different from the others but unique like you could tell it's his heart his art right away like you could tell a rocky's art is his right away or akira toriyama's right away or um what's another good one the art style in berserk i forgot the name of the artist i i i had it in my head but it, it just i left i'm sorry it's been a long time since i've dabbled in anything berserk related since it hasn't updated <clears throat> yeah but no um this kid mm -mm. dad just he just knows he knows how hard it is to be here why did they defend my father i mean and they probably understand but he goes too far why did they only ever say, don't cry to me? I can't take it anymore. They're probably saying that because uh, you got to be tough. But sometimes you got to be, you got to 
treat some kids differently. I mean, especially with Shigaraki, he's a little bit sensitive. You gotta be a little bit more. I mean, you don't not baby him. You could be strict, but you gotta have a balance, basically. Especially at the I don't know what age he is, eight, whatever. He's he's at a young age. You gotta like. You gotta don't don't over for the future it, it, you did but you know i'm just saying don't be too hard on on the kid you can be hard on the kid if they do something wrong but don't be too hard oh boy there goes the mother tenko my god this guy's art is so good oh boy now that is a good mother even when she's falling apart she's uh running to embrace him and her clothes are going to that, I'm not, gore is not my thing. I'm sure some people out there. My God, this art is so cool. I, I gotta stop going out. I gotta stop going off on tangents. Back then. Oh boy. How's the father gonna react to it? Is he gonna smack the existence out of him again? Or is he actually going to do something like, uh, that's going to make me feel different about his character? <clears throat> oh boy. Oh boy. Please, I live a happy, li please live a happy life full of smiles from now on. Mm -hmm. uh, it's something... Oh boy. <laughs> How's the father gonna react? It can go two ways. Well, three ways. Does the dad have a quirk? Okay, I know this is serious, but. <laughs> that's that's kind of funny. <laughs> Just knock him out. <laughs> Alright. That caught me off guard. <laughs> <clears throat> Smack him with whatever that is. I don't know what that is. I'm not gonna pretend to know what that is. I mean, the dad realized right away something's off. He doesn't know exactly what the hell's happening. Stop it, Tenko. Is that his? That's the dad. Yeah. Okay, that's not Tenko. Tenko reaching uh, out to his dad. Back then, I. <clears throat> you looked a lot like Midoriya. <laughs> Midoriya. Midoriya. Whatever. Oh, he actually went to. Okay, I guess he understood. Yeah. Alright. Well, then. For a purposeful killing intent, I touched my father. Where did your son touch you? Can you show me on this doll? <laughs> <laughs> oh, and thumbnail, probably, and the most pleasant feeling spread through my body. Hmm, that might have been something he always had in him then. Well, who knows? I don't know. I'm not gonna pretend to know. Why am I acting like a? Therapist slash psychologist slash a mental analyst. I don't know anything about that. Whatever. I just have surface level knowledge <clears throat> that anybody can obtain. Somewhere deep within my heart, I had always wished something like this would happen. Oh, okay. Okay. Ah, that's what that's what the itch was. Okay. So this chapter was just Chigaraki killing his entire family. Good job, Chigaraki. Oh. Good job, I guess. Uh, I, he just broke. The kid broke. And well, if his quirk hadn't manifested, this wouldn't have happened, but. Maybe because he broke whatever his quirk was supposed to be, mutated. I'm trying to imagine what the hell his quirk could have been before the mutation, or maybe the mutation was already a thing that had happened in his body and 
just as quirk hadn't hadn't fully hadn't really manifested yet yeah i'm gonna go with that that's the most possible one because that's not how, mutations don't work like that or do they i don't know i'm not a scientist but yeah <clears throat> basically this whole itch that i was up to say midoriya midoriya uh, this whole itch that shigaraki had uh or, or tenko uh was um i guess the stress that his that the that the home that his father made well I guess home yeah that his father made brought to him uh, eventually piling stress upon stress upon stress upon stress accumulating a, an amount of stress that a little kid would not be able to handle hell I mean I say a little kid but some adults can't handle stress a lot too and and uh, his breaking point kind of happened at the same time I was looking for a big word but hell okay I can't it kind of happened at the same time that his quirk manifested causing him to break even further had his quirk not manifested at that point would have happened but yeah and the itch finally being gone It was a psychological thing from his father, I guess. He's not, I guess, question, because I don't remember. Um, does Shigaraki screechy scratchy his eyes, or does he ever talk about being screechy scratchy ever before this? I don't think so. Or maybe, no, 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 I don't think so. He is scratching, but he's never complaining about an itch. So I guess it's just regular creeple scratching. No, no, it can't be. And maybe he just hasn't mentioned it. Whatever. Um, yeah, this was a um, was a nice follow up chapter. Um, not much to say about it because it was just Chigaraki murdering his entire family, and yeah, he went after the dad. But blah, blah, whatever. That's it. That's the story. That's it, I guess, after this, the flashback's over, or maybe we'll have one more chapter where we see All For One adopt him. I hope not. I hope we just go back to the brawl at, at the city, because I feel this this is all we need to know. What do we need to know with oh, All For One finding him and adopting him? We already know... That he's like, oh, these are the hands of your family members. Oh, uh, there's a hand right there. These are the fa hands of your family members. And I'm going to whatever, whatever, la 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 la, whatever he said. And he became his mentor. I don't think we need to know any. We need to know the ins and outs of everything he ever did. I think this is all we need to know about him. That's it. We're just gonna, after this one, we're probably just gonna go back to the big brawl at the city. Gigantamaki is in. Um, yeah. Twice is released. And Toga is probably dead. I doubt it. I hope not. I write, I'm going to write if Toga. 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 It's been a... Toga. 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 She's, she can't be dead. I mean, she's not gonna come off like perfectly fine, but she she's she's not gonna be dead. I kind of hope that the doctor guy ends up. I mean, I don't know. Would he be able to give him give them more quirks? I th maybe. I mean, this is that's kind of more of an all for one thing. But maybe they can, if they may, if if what's his face, Pelican Plague Doctor. Um had the anti the takey the take the quirky takey awakey vaccine then maybe they'll be able to do something with that who knows all for one probably has a bunch of stuff prepared for them to make them stronger because he knows they're not ready so yeah i mean gigantamaki is going to be a huge help for them but like maybe one extra quirk for them would be nice i, I don't think shigaraki needs it at all Maybe a healing quirk would be nice for him. A self-healing quirk. Twice. 
would need some he has the kagebunshin no jutsu but uh i don't know having like a little doesn't have to be anything super powerful just like a random thing oh uh shooting orbs of and of of shooting orbs whatever not not mineta sticky balls but you know i don't know, just give him an extra thing to help him out uh toga probably doesn't need it because of her new I wouldn't say awakening, but like her new discovery that her that she can use other people's quirks, or maybe it's because of the amount of blood she took. Who knows? But yeah, I don't have anything else to say. Uh, if I keep going, I'm just gonna keep droning on because there's a lot to talk about with my hero. I don't know why. why I don't know why. <laughs> I'm gonna go. This is H Extraordinary. If you like this video, make sure to like the video. And if you dislike the video, make sure to subscribe and click on that notification bell. <laughs> um, I'm gonna go. I hope you enjoyed the chapter and B. <laughs> that was terrible. <laughs>